Welcome, in front of me I have Call Me M42 watch and I'm gonna show you how to enable the phone notifications for this watch on the iPhone. Basically, if you want to receive the notifications uh, from your iPhone on your watch. Before we start, if you want to receive the notifications from your iPhone on your watch, your watch needs to be paired with your iPhone via the uh, Fit Cloud Pro application. And once the devices are paired together, we can continue. And now we can uh, make sure, rather we need to make sure that the required permissions are allowed uh, for the FitCloud Pro application and your iPhone to send the notifications to your watch. So, uh, go to your iPhone, that is paired with your watch of course, find the settings icon and tap on it to open the settings. In settings, find the Bluetooth option and tap on it. And here you should see the list of my devices and on it you should see the M42. Tap on the info icon next to it. And here you should see a couple of options and one of them should be share system notifications. If you're missing this option, uh, close the settings for now. Open the FitCloud Pro application on the iPhone. In the app, tap on device icon. And here you should see the M42 and it should say connected. Now tap on push notifications. If the notifications are turned on, turn them off, then turn them back on and wait a couple of seconds. You will probably see the pop-up on the screen about the notification permission. Once you see it, allow all of the notification permissions. Once you allow them, go back to settings. So let's uh, close the app, open the settings again. Uh, in settings, go back to Bluetooth and then tap on the info, make sure you the share system notification option is here and it's enabled. Once it is enabled, go back to the main page of settings, uh, find the Fleet Cloud Pro icon. It's gonna be somewhere here at the bottom. Once you find it, tap on it and here make sure that the Bluetooth option is enabled. Once it is, close the settings and now we can open the Fleet Cloud Pro application and we can uh, tap on devices or device icon here uh, tap on push notifications turn on the notifications and once you turn them on you will be able to turn on and off the notifications for specific features and apps as you can see and how it works is uh, if for example you turn on notifications for uh, sms and you receive the notification from sms on your iphone that notification will be forwarded to your watch but if you disable it it won't be forwarded to your watch, so you will see it only on your uh, iPhone. Okay, and as you can see, we have limited uh, amount of apps right here on the list, and some of the apps are not here. For example, I want to be able to receive the notifications from Discord, but the Discord is not on the list. And to do, to make it work, we need to enable the option uh, at the bottom called More Reminders. Once you enable this option, the notifications will be enabled for the, uh, not, uh, for the apps that are not on this list, for example, Discord and other apps that you have installed. Okay, and once we're done, we can close the app. We should be able to receive the notifications. So I'm gonna send myself a message on Discord. And as you can see, we got the notification on our iPhone and also on our watch. And that's how you enable the phone notifications uh, for this watch on the iPhone. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving the like on the video.